So I'm a plein air painter and plein air basically means uh, painting outdoors. And we have a long standing tradition in Canada of painting outdoors starting with the group of seven. Um, the thing about painting outdoors, the reason why I like it so much is, is that you are responding immediately to what you see. Things are changing very quickly. Lights changing, weather's changing, clouds are changing, colors are changing. So you have to respond to it very fast. And that intimacy and urgency is what gives the paintings their freshness. Um, so we paint small, eight by 10, um, paint on, on wooden panel. Um, it's cheap, it's light, you can stack a pile of these into your backpack and off you go. It's a real convenient way to, to um, work from. Um, and what we do is, is, like I say, paint as quickly as you possibly can. So it's about economy of brush strokes. Trying to say the most you possibly can with the least amount of effort as quick as possible while things, while things change. And then from these plein air sketches, field sketches as we call them, um, we then come to our studio and work up larger pieces. So here's an example. This is a, a field sketch done in the headwaters of the Kitimat River on our, on our project. Um, done outside and then I take this and come back in and create a studio piece. And the big difference with the studio piece is now I have all the time in the world. There are no mosquitoes, there's no grizzly bears, there's no hunger, there's no rain. Um, you have time to think about it all. Um, but almost to the point where you have too much time. So my process once I get back in the studio is try to take the same energy that I used outside to then apply that back onto the canvas. I don't want to overthink things. I don't want to be thinking too much about color. I still want to have that energy and that brush stroke. So I basically do the same thing. I take a canvas, paint it brown, the same as, as I've done with one of these panels, um, and then just go in very quickly blocking out the colors and the shapes and keeping the brush strokes um, as active as I possibly can and not overpainting it. You can still see through the canvas much as you can in the field sketches there's still lots of the wood showing through and you can see lots of the canvas showing through. So what it allows me to do is paint quite fast, not have to overpaint anything, keep shapes nice and crisp. Um, and it really allows me to use negative space as much as possible in my work. It's not a layer upon a layer upon a layer. It really does speak about the positive shapes and the negative shapes. Um, and allows me to paint this very quickly and attempt to try to recreate the energy that you see in a field sketch.